a poet, a historian, an old friend, an icon. I never met Vin Scully, but to generations of Dodger fans, he was this and so much more. Vin passed away last week at his home at Hinn Hills in my assembly district at the age of 94. For more than 60 years, he was the iconic voice of the Los Angeles Dodgers. From Jackie Robinson to Sandy Koufax to Clayton Kershaw, Vin wrote the first draft of history for some of the greatest moments in baseball history, the beloved narrator for our boys in blue. Vin was a master of his craft who was unmatched in skill and longevity. His trademark cadence, extraordinary literary skill, and folksy charm made him a legend in Los Angeles and across the nation. He was inducted into the Baseball Hall of Fame and voted by his peers in the American Sportscaster Association as the greatest sportscaster of all time. But the admiration wasn't just from the fans. It may sound corny, Dodger Hall of Famer Sandy Koufax once said, but I enjoyed listening to Vin call a game almost more than playing in them. Vin was so much more than a sportscaster. He was also an A-plus human being a kind, humble, and gracious man who endured deep personal tragedy and loss. He told the Daily News that he wanted to be remembered not as a famous broadcaster, but simply as someone who lived up to his own beliefs. Vin will be deeply missed by his family, friends, and so many of us in the San Fernando Valley who felt as if he was our friend. We may not have met Vin Scully, but he was somebody that we loved. I respectfully request that we adjourn today in his memory.